Well, Minister of Public Administration and Communications Maxi Kaffi is today bringing clarity to the mandate and makeup of the new TTT announced last Friday. He was refuting a letter written by Indira Sajiwan Ali, which dubbed the closure of CNMG as a mere cosmetic name change. The minister says as the Caribbean new media group CNMG is being wound up, a new board will be appointed to achieve a novel mandate of creating a local media company with a bias towards the production and procurement of local content. This in contrast to CNMG's directive, which was to compete against private media houses with a view to a profitable bottom line. He says the new TTT will not be solely profit-driven and indeed will be established as a public service broadcaster with its costs being borne by the government. The minister also says the new TTT will be mandated to have universal appeal, portray the diversity of cultures that represent Trinidad and Tobago, promote national identity, as well as provide a platform for local content and provide studio and editing services. Unlike CNMG, the soon-to-be-created TTT, he says, will also be required to provide public and government information and news. He states that the government's subvention for the new entity will not be increased, but notes that funds will come not only from the public purse, but also from donors and commercial revenues.